Hey, hi guys, welcome to Simplifying Tech and Programming. So in today's session, we are going to check how we can download and install Spring Tool Suite. So basically, STS is a extended version of Eclipse which, which supports uh, Spring, Spring and Spring Boot applications and uh, their configurations. So we are going to check STS features and how we can download, install and configure Spring Tool Suite on Windows. So we are going to see useful features of uh, Spring Tool Suite for developing Spring application. So first we will show the benefits of using STS compared to traditional way of building the application with Eclipse and thereafter we will focus on how to bootstrap the application and how to run and how to add the additional dependencies and uh, finally like uh, we are conclude with uh, running the application with Spring Tool Suite. So STS main feature it will based on Eclipse development environment and uh, which is customized for development of Spring and Spring Boot applications. So it provides ready to use environment to implement, debug, run and deploy your application. It also includes like in integration with the clouds uh, like Piotal TC server and Piotal Cloud Foundry, Git, Maven and Aspect.j. So STS is built as an additional on top of latest Eclipse releases. So moving to second step, let's go to download and uh, download the Spring Tool Suite. So go to your favorite browser and type download STS. Okay, so go here. So it is saying Spring Tool Suite 4. So basically Spring Tool Suite 4 is the next generation Spring uh, tooling and favorite coding environment. So this is uh, Spring Tools 4. So Spring uh, Tools 4 is the next generation of Spring tooling for your coding environment. Okay, so we have lots of support available. So this Spring Tool Suite for Eclipse also and this Spring Tool Suite for Visual Studio and for Thai also. Okay, so we will select this uh, 4.16.0 Windows version and say download. Okay, so it will start the download. In my case, it is already downloaded. So I'm canceling this. So I'm going to tools. So here uh, our Spring tool suit is there. So which is the jar file. So just double click on this jar file. Okay, so it is basically unpacked uh, the jar file. So here it is a STS4. So just go to Spring tool suit 4 just right click on this and uh, create send to desktop okay so double click on this yeah so our spring tool suit 4 is ready to open okay so it is asking for workspace so you can give any folder from your uh, machine and let's say launch okay so this is what uh, spring tool suit idea look like so here uh, like you will see is create new spring starter project so this option you will not see into the eclipse so uh, it should visible into the spring tool suit only so click on this so it is going the going to show service url as start.spring.io so this is default yeah so keep project name as it is so type gradle project so we will select maven project packaging as a jar java version as a whatever uh, you would like so in my case i am selecting java 8 then language is java and just say next so here like uh, you should be required spring web so select uh, sp type web and select the spring web okay and then say next and then say finish okay so our uh, spring boot uh, project is created so in our previous session like uh, we have developed like uh, this api like uh, gate mapping so copy this go here and add this method here and we have to specify here at the rate rest controller okay import the package here import this package for gate mapping okay so our uh, application is ready so just start it okay so our application is started on port 8080 so copy this go to browser and type local host colon 8080 slash yeah here we go so this is the welcome to simplifying tech spring boot sts app so whatever we have given here so that is coming from here
okay so this way we can uh, download and install uh, spring tool suit latest version and we can uh, develop and deploy the applications based on spring and spring boot thanks a lot for watching